And these are the visuals we're getting for you from Delhi Metro. Prime Minister, Prime Minister Narendra Modi is accompanied by the visiting Australian dignitary Malcolm Turnbull, Australian Prime Minister. And they have started from the Monday House Metro station in the national capital. We have the Australian Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull at the Monday House Metro station taking a look at the architectural marvel of the national capital, Delhi Metro, which is synonymous with the essence of Delhi. And here we have the Prime Minister acquainting the visiting dignitary with what Delhi Metro is. And from here on, we expect both the dignitaries to travel by metro. And at present, both of them are at Mundi House Metro Station, which is at Connaught Place, near Delhi. The Indian Prime Minister acquainting the Australian Prime Minister with Delhi Metro. And here we have the visuals. We know Delhi Metro has been serving New Delhi and its satellite cities of Faridabad, Noida, also Gurgaon and Ghaziabad. And it is, we know, the world's 12th largest metro system when we talk of both length and the number of stations. So here we have Australian Prime Minister getting a first-hand account of how Delhi Metro functions. Now we have a total of 160 stations serving through Delhi Metro. Earlier in the day we saw uh, the Australian Prime Minister had held bilateral uh, talks with the Indian Prime Minister and we saw six MOUs had been signed between both the nations. This is the first visit of the Australian Prime Minister to India. Earlier we saw the Indian Prime Minister meet the Australian Prime Minister on the sidelines of the G20 meet in 2015 and 16 and this time it will be for the first time that both the leaders have had a one-on-one -on -one meeting which happened today afternoon earlier in the day the, uh, the visiting uh, Australian Prime Minister also visited Rajkot and he paid floral tributes to the father of the nation there and external affairs minister Sushma Swaraj also called upon the visiting dignitary here we have both the leaders at Monday House Metro station in the national capital and both the leaders are most likely to travel by a metro train at Mundi House. Both the leaders are waving to the general public who is standing there to have a glimpse. And the crowds there waving to the, to the Indian Prime Minister. And we have the chance of Modi, Modi, evident of the aura the Prime Minister has. Now we know this is the first visit of the Australian Prime Minister to India. He has talked of how India is scripting a positive growth story and how he looks forward to taking the existing relationship between the two countries to the next level. And now both the leaders will work closely to deepen the bond between the nations. And here we have both the leaders at Monday House Metro Station. The Australian Prime Minister is acquainting himself with one of the marvels of the national capital of the country, the Delhi Metro. The Delhi Metro has an average daily ridership of more than 2 million passengers and the very... Alright, here we have the crowd there going berserk. chance of Modi Modi there. The welcome the Prime Minister there is getting from his countrymen at Mundi House Rail Metro Station in the national capital. And this is the charisma, the charm of the Indian Prime Minister, which attracts the people there, the countrymen there, waving, trying to shake hands with the Prime Minister. We have both the leaders, the Australian Prime Minister and the Indian Prime Minister at the Mundi House Metro Station.
Australian Prime Minister very nicely smiling at the warm welcome which is being witnessed at the Mundi House metro station in the national capital. Both the leaders from here are likely to have, to, likely to take a metro ride, take a ride in Delhi metro. All right, our correspondent Amrit Paul Singh is joining us to get us more on that. Amrit, both the leaders there are at the Delhi Metro. We've seen Prime Minister also, when he has visited uh, the nations abroad, he also has made an effort to take a look and learn from the transport systems in different parts of the uh, world, wherever he has visited. And today we have the Australian Prime Minister acquainting himself with the marvel of the national capital, the Delhi Metro. Oh, absolutely. You know, uh, this is clearly a sight uh, with Prime Minister Modi uh, and Prime Minister Turnbull uh, at the Mundi House metro station uh, in the heart of New Delhi near the near Connaught Place. This is Prime Minister Turnbull's uh, first visit to India. Now, as India becomes, you know, remember when uh, he started uh, this visit, he said, what a growth story India is. So, uh, metro in that sense is uh, a symbol of uh, an aspiring India, an India which wants to uh, catch the road to development and fast track the development process. So clearly, uh, what better uh, uh, symbolism than uh, uh, watching the metro, which is one of the world class, uh, uh, you know, tube systems. So in that sense, the Prime Minister uh, uh, Turnbull actually uh, uh, coming down with Prime Minister Modi during his first visit and actually seeing how India uh, wishes to get onto the road of. Uh, uh, progress and development and uh, Australia and India can partner together uh, by uh, be it in the field of energy, be it in the field of education, be it in the field of sciences, uh, be it in the field of uh, science and technology. Uh, so, you know, clearly uh, 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 this symbolism reflects that. All right, these are the visuals we're getting for you from Monday House. <clears throat> Exclusive visuals, Prime Minister Narendra Modi and visiting Australian Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull taking a ride in the Delhi Metro. Both the leaders are at Monday House Metro Station in the national capital. And as we know, Delhi Metro is symbolic of the very inspiring growth story which... Malcolm Turnbull referred to before he reached India and he talked of what a perfect growth story India pictures and here we have both the leaders waving to the general masses the riders there who've come for a ride to Delhi Metro but I'm sure they were they, they would have been taken by surprise to see the visiting dignitaries there at Metro Station Amrit Pal is still with us Amrit uh, how significant has been the day today? We saw both the leaders, uh, they had bilateral talks in the morning. Six MOUs had been signed and now we have both of them taking a ride in the metro. Uh, let us know more. And all right, here we have on our screens Australian Prime Minister taking a selfie. Amrit, if I'm audible to you, please yes. let us know how important has been the day today. We have... A very good sense of rapport between both the two leaders there, Australian Prime Minister clicking a selfie with the Indian Prime Minister. Very symbolic. The body language there between the two leaders, very symbolic when we talk of the aspirations of the Australian Prime Minister, when he talked of taking the bilateral relationship to the next level. Well, what you saw a little while back at the Hyderabad House was uh, a formal agreements being signed in a formal setting of the Hyderabad, of the stately Hyderabad House. And here we see... Uh, the two prime ministers uh, of uh, Asian giants actually in a very informal setting, mm. sitting in a metro, taking selfies along uh, uh, with, uh, on the right is uh, the High Commissioner to India, Harjit uh, Sidhu, uh, can the Canadian High Commissioner to India, Harjit Sidhu, Prime Minister uh, Turnbull and Prime Minister Modi chatting. It's uh, what we know is that uh, Prime Minister Modi, uh, what we know is that Prime Minister Modi, 
uh, and Prime Minister Turnbull are uh, expected to uh, go down to Akshar Dham uh, 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 Temple. Um, uh, they are traveling in the metro. They took this metro uh, from Mandi House. So that means they travel a few uh, kilometers down this metro lane. Uh, and yes, I'm seeing... just for the information of our viewers, both the leaders have now reached Pragati Medan metro station. A short while back, they started from Mandi House metro station in the national capital. Amrit, we were talking of uh, the rapport between both the leaders. Please continue. Oh, absolutely. You know, this is reflective of uh, how, uh, you know, uh, the, 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 the trust that uh, is uh, the growing trust between the two uh, countries. Uh, Prime Minister Turnbull uh, repeatedly taking selfies, see the relaxed mood uh, uh, between the two uh, leaders and, uh, uh, you know, it's a very, very informal setting. Now, what happens is, of course, you know, when two nations interact, there are their interests that are paramount, national interests that are, that are paramount, and that's what guides the relationship and drives the relationship. But the personal chemistry between the two leaders uh, of, or any two principles uh, uh, can uh, be uh, a factor to give the push. Now, when Prime Minister Turnbull had met Prime Minister Modi first time on the sidelines of G20 in China, um, uh, that is when he had just become the Prime Minister. So uh, they had struck a repo and over the period of time this relationship has grown. Uh, it finally uh, fructified into uh, this visit, uh, state visit of the Australian Prime Minister to India. Uh, now, um, you know, after concluding a formal business, the two uh, uh, leaders uh, just taking a leisurely uh, metro ride to the Akshar Dham uh, station speaks much about how uh, the relationship between uh, the two principles is reflective of the growing uh, relation, uh, relationship of trust, cooperation and coming together of the two uh, great uh, uh, countries. I mean, uh, you know, Prime Minister Turnbull said that uh, we, we highly appreciated Prime Minister uh, Modi's initiative on the Solar Alliance and finally Australia decided to join the Solar Alliance. Now Australia throwing its weight behind the International Solar Alliance uh, uh, would give a big push to, uh, uh, to the International Solar Alliance. Now these, this kind of personal chemistry and personal report does play an important role in pushing uh, the relationship forward, which we can, which is clearly evident in the visuals that we see on our screens right now. Um, you know, uh, when uh, uh, Prime Minister, when both Prime Ministers took um, the, this metro, and at this hour, pretty as you would know, Metro uh, Mandi House is very uh, close uh, to Connaught Place. It's a very crowded station. There were people on the other side. So the two Prime Ministers waving, especially Prime Minister Turnbull, waving at uh, the commuters who must have been taken by surprise. So, uh, and... Uh, uh, so, you know, in this informal setting, it talks about how the relations, there, there is a sense of... Yes, uh, yes, the two leaders uh, have just uh, departed, the, have left the Indraprastha uh, station. And uh, for the information of our viewers who've joined us late, uh, the Prime Minister of both the two countries, they started from uh, Monday House Metro Station in the national capital. And we also had beautiful moments where both the leaders waved to the commuters there. And we also had the Australian Prime Minister click a selfie and he's perhaps showing the selfie and he's perhaps posting it on the social media there. Amrit, we were talking with you and we were talking of this rapport between the two leaders. Also, uh, let us know more as to how significant and how important has been the day. Six MOUs had been signed between both the leaders. Uh, apart from that, uh, as the Indian Prime Minister said, a gamut of the whole gamut of uh, issues have been taken up uh, by the two leaders. What have been the most important takeaways? Okay, before we talk about that, let me tell you that I can confirm with you that now the two leaders are actually proceeding towards Akshadam uh, right. Temple. Uh, they will be uh, getting off at the Akshadam station. They've crossed three stations from Mandi House, uh, taken this uh, metro ride. Uh, I have personally taken this route many times, so I know uh, you must have also taken this route, Preeti. So, you know, it's just a few, uh, few stations away. And um, the, the Prime, Minister, Prime Minister Turnbull taking out time from his hectic schedule and also Prime Minister Modi uh, uh, on a day when, uh, you know, uh, an international leader is in town, on a day when the parliament is on, uh, the, the Prime Minister taking out time and, you know, investing time uh, with uh, in, in, in a very uh, informal setting that speaks of the bon homie that's clearly evident on the screens. Uh, important uh, day, yes. Uh, six very important agreements right from combating terror, uh, money laundering, uh, transnational crime, uh, cooperation and that, 
cooperation in the field of higher education, uh, a huge delegation accompanied. Uh, which and here the leaders have reached the Yamuna Bank station. And we have the commuters there waving to the Indian Prime Minister. And they're caught by surprise. This is a very interesting yes, side where small little it? children have come on to the platform. <laughs> they are waving. They're looking at Prime Minister Modi and Prime Minister Turnbull at uh, this Yamuna Bank station. People actually trying to get out and take a selfie. Um, uh, I cannot see any security around. So people, these are people on the platform, clearly taken by surprise. You can see the enthusiasm. And I'm sure uh, even the Australian security. Prime Minister must have also been taken by surprise. The, the, the warm welcome, the overwhelming response, which was seen at the Mandi House metro station. Uh, the people, the commuters, they're chanting Modi, Modi. And here we have the children rushing to take a glimpse, to catch a glimpse of the uh, Indian Prime Minister there, isn't it, Amrit? Both the Indian Prime Minister and the Australian Prime Minister, and you can see the uh, you know the sense of uh, amusement on the face of uh, the Australian Prime Minister. He's clearly pleasantly taken by surprise, where people just rushed right up to the window pane of the metro, <laughs> and uh, you know they try to wave him, uh, wave to him, try to take selfies. And it was a little while before the metro security realized what was happening and try and come and you know build right. a human chain and get them away, but. Uh, it surely speaks of uh, uh, the, the, the bonhomie that we can see right now. Uh, also, it's symbolic of uh, a growing India, an India which is on the fast uh, track of development, which Prime Minister Turnbull referred to before he uh, came to India, uh, where when he said what a growth story India is today at the Hyderabad House after the uh, signing of the agreement, saying that, uh, you, uh, uh, referring to uh, Prime Minister Modi, saying you're the leader of the largest uh, democracy of the world, uh, the, uh, um, you know, you are on a path to uh, development. We would, uh, we, we uh, uh, think very highly of your growth story and would want to be an important partner in it. So today, uh, taking this metro journey uh, is uh, symbolic of that, of uh, the infrastructure uh, uh, forward movement and development that India seeks and uh, the, the growth story of India uh, that carries on. Right, Amrit, we also saw in the morning the Prime Minister uh, said that six MOUs have been signed. Terror was one of uh, the areas where both the leaders signed an MOU. Uh, let us, uh, I would want you to emphasize more on the peace and stability in the Indo-Pacific region and also how Prime Minister said that terrorism and cyber security uh, require global strategy. Uh, at the same time, uh, both the leaders also talked of uh, combating terrorism and joining hands in the field. Uh, let us know more about that. And here we have uh, both the leaders getting ready to get off from the metro train to the Akshardham metro station. Uh, yes, they've reached the Akshardham metro yes. station. Uh, uh, you know, uh, Prime Minister Turnbull put on his glasses and tried to look at the Akshardham uh, uh, temple, which you can see from the metro itself. Now they've uh, uh, disembarked from the metro and uh, are at the Akshardham station. Uh, they've taken a, a ride from uh, the uh, Mandi House metro station uh, to uh, the Akshardham metro station. Yes, Amrit, so we have both the leaders there reach, reach the Akshardham metro station and uh, what is to be noticed is that earlier uh, they witnessed the lifeline of the national capital, um, an architectural marvel the Delhi Metro is. And now they're going to uh, witness another architectural marvel, Akshardham Temple, which is uh, indeed one of the wonders when we talk, which is uh, in East Delhi. And here we have both the leaders leave the metro station, Akshardham Metro station in the national capital. Well, I'm sure Prime Minister Turnbull would have been pleasantly surprised and, they, you know, this is what he would have been looking forward to, to the wonder that India is. Yes. Here you have uh, metro, a uh, symbolism of development, a symbolism of growth, a symbolism of an India aspiring to be uh, modern and right on the bank of that, uh, right next to that is um, the uh, Akshardham Temple, which is uh, actually uh, modeled on the original Akshardham Temple of Gujarat. Uh,